Today on my channel, we're doing something a little different. We are doing Modern Glam Christmas. Today I am participating in the Modern Glam Christmas Decor Challenge hosted by Cindy from Z9 Designs. Now you're going to definitely want to check out her channel. She makes the cutest DIYs. I love to watch her videos and you will find the link to her channel and the playlist for the Modern Glam Christmas Challenge listed in the description box below. So I am a little out of my wheelhouse today with Modern Glam, but I thought I would give it a shot. So I bought a whole case full of these ornaments from the Dollar Tree. And I'm just going to take some gold paint that I already have, and if you saw my title, you saw that it said French Provincial Christmas Modern Glam or Baroque Modern Glam. And the reason being is that the colors that I'm using, I'm using this rich gold and I'm going to be covering uh, both of the ornaments with this. I have two of them, the bell and the circular one that you see there. And this is getting a solid color. It's not distressed or anything like that because I really think when you're doing the modern design that you have your colors are just um, solid on your pieces. And so that's what I'm doing. Paint the front and the back. Now I'm gonna take some painter's tape and we're gonna paint a stripe because I also think a solid stripe is kind of more of a modern look too. So that's what I'm doing here. But then again, I'm gonna take my fusion paint that I just purchased. This is fusion mineral paint. And I have to say, I love this paint and I love this color. This is called French eggshell. I am completely in love with this. I have been dying to use it. I couldn't wait to use it. And so I decided to use it on these ornaments here. So I hope you kind of get what I'm saying when I say like French Provincial because um, I have the colors are kind of more along like European uh, Christmas or French designs, but um, I'm trying to keep them in solid colors, not to stress anything, to make it look old keep it new looking so that it has that modern look to it. And also, I think the gold has the bling to it that you would use um, with modern types of decor. I'm pulling my tape up while the paint is still somewhat wet. All right, let's talk about these Dollar Tree snowflakes. So originally I painted one side of them gold, and then after I painted them gold, I decided, and then put glitter on it, I decided I did not like it. Um, you'll see me putting the glitter on it in a minute, but I wanted to use that gold ribbon that you see me putting on there, and I'm trying to just decide where I want to put it when I have the snowflake on there. But I ended up turning those snowflakes over and just using the raw wood side and Mod Podging that. And um, I'm Mod Podging this too also right now, um, as you can see. And I decided to flip the snowflakes over and just use the raw wood part and Mod Podge it and then um, put glitter on it, which you will see me do in a few minutes here. And I'm just smoothing down those sides after I've trimmed them to uh, make sure that they're not sticking up. It's kind of hard to get it trimmed just exactly around that edge. I was trying to do the best that I could with that, but that's what I'm doing here.
what I was talking about. You didn't see me flip these over, but I did flip them over and Mod Podge the back and decided to just use the raw wood side with the glitter because I thought that that ended up looking better. I thought that there was too much gold going on. All right, so now I'm taking these and I'm just trying to figure out exactly where I want them. And I'm gonna put them right in the middle. I'm gonna take some tacky glue and glue them on there right in the center. And we're gonna go ahead and let that dry. So now I think I'm done and I am Mod Podging the entire thing. Give that a nice good coat dry but then I say no it's still too plain so I go and get some more ribbon now this is from my pack that I showed you in my vintage uh, tiered tray Christmas video the pack of ribbon that I had this ribbon came from that pack and I'll link that video for you um, in the cards and below in the description box in case you're interested in it but that's where this ribbon came from and I decided to add it it has the gold trim and it has the kind of off-white that matches the glitter and I felt it just added to it and again it still has those straight kind of striped clean lines that you would see um, in a modern type style and then it has the gold which gives it the bling for the glam style. Okay so now how would you hang this? Well you could drill a hole in the top. Actually, you probably would want to do that before you started painting and then loop some ribbon through that. That's one way of uh, putting a hanger on it or some wire. Or you can do like I'm going to do here and I'm just going to take some glue and I'm going to glue the ribbon onto the back. And this is just quick. I do have a staple gun. I'm not sure where it is. I need to really find it because I think that would work too. Put two staples on either side there and that would secure a uh, ribbon also. But that's what we're gonna go ahead and do right here. some all over glitter and I also added some pearls to the center of the snowflakes to give it a little more dimension. modern glam ornaments. Don't forget to check out Cindy's channel and the playlist. I want to thank you so much for watching today. Let me know if you liked these ornaments, what you think, what style they actually are. I'd be interested in knowing in the comments. Here's another video for you in case you're interested. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next one.